Hey, Rudel here. I am in the um, pre-firing stages of a mini sculpture, the first part of my series, Megalopolis. This is ceramic, and uh, it's skyscrapers, and the skyscrapers are being overtaken by butterflies. Uh, they're kind of one in the same, or veneered. Uh, down here are hundreds of bottles. Can you see them? And each butterfly is a bottle, and each bottle is a butterfly. I try to bring the windows in, so you could still have some kind of an architectural feeling to the, um, the buildings. And this is kind of difficult to view through a camera. I find my work incredibly difficult to photograph because of the hyper detail. Um, this is just the underglaze. So when it's finished, all these colors will be uh, richer. I wanted to show you something else. I'm going to embellish more garbage around the base of the skyscrapers, the base of the city. Here's a piece of garbage I'm working on right now. It literally looks like a piece of a butterfly that was a piece of paper that was crinkled up and tossed away. Hmm, wonder where I got that idea. <laughs> Here's some other pieces of garbage. We have a rafter and a box and some cable when this is finished all of these pieces of garbage will be fused onto the base of the city to um, add the feeling of um, human consumption and human waste and uh, the struggle between man and nature and also that I feel that we are um, we veneer or under underestimate what the damage we've done to the planet and the destruction we've done to the web of life. This piece will be up for auction on January 8th at the Think Space Gallery on Santa Monica Boulevard in Los Angeles, California. Uh, it's a fundraiser for endangered species called um, Born Free. Um, unlike the art other artists, I'm donating 100% instead of 20% of my profit from this sculpture to uh, the Born Free organization. Um, I will get a finished photograph and video of this when it is uh, completely fired with its second glaze in two days. Thanks for listening.